Sweet, there you go. Well, it's a long day. Almost there. Got them all up. Holes are drilled, mate. Sweet. It's almost 4.20, so I'm going in, folks. Sweet. Bit big. Probably that one. And that one's for there. And as you can see, it goes bigger, so it's good. The cup's going to drop in there and sit on there. That one's straight up and down, that pot, so it's going to have to make sure the hole's drilled straight. And that one's perfect because the cup gets bigger at the top. Give them a good wash, obviously. That's the one I got from the back of the uh, nursery. And, you know, for example, that's the pack it came in. You know, metal teeth, could go through plastic. Now, this is a pack I got a USB stick in, mate. Tiny little USB stick. Two bits of plastic and a... I don't get it, mate. Too much wrapping these days. So that's going to be handy for the smaller ones. And after you clean these off a little bit, because it's just going to be in the water, you don't want all that dirt running through the system. You got this little beauty here, mate. So the middle bit actually came in this kit and I uh, only had two allen keys so I was very lucky the only two allen keys in the whole house one of them fit uh, that little hole there mate and uh, I've tightened me drill bit in to the big bit and now that's come out of this kit too so I was lucky enough that that's going to work so he's going to drill the hole into our PVC pipes now I'm just going to work out exactly how, how to space them I'm probably going to start from the middle and go outwards we'll see what happens mate sweet this is going to come in handy today too, folks. Sweet. Good one. All right, well, Matilda's helping me again. Got this finally set up. Worked out how to set it all up. And here's my test piece. Like I said, keep a few bits. Keep a box full of junk. And uh, I'm going to try and put my hole in there. I'm going to put my cup in and see how far down it drops. Because, you know, the root's going to come down a little bit. So if it, I just want to break the top just want to break the top and make a circle so the cup can fit in because it's tapered so it gets a bit bigger at the top of the cup and then the roots actually come down through the cup below the cup so you don't want them dragging in the water just dragging in you kind of want them dangling power tool safety tip yeah make sure you put this over your shoulder put the cord over your shoulder so it's coming down and then you can lean down on this thing right with this boy if you go too quick it's going to grab and you might break the bit in the middle, which I just did. And I didn't even, it was the first go man, full on. Um, and what I did, I, you go down till it gets the hole out, get that out of the middle, be stuck in there possibly. And then, instead of going straight down, angle it a little bit this way, just a little bit. And you can even use the side to grate off a little bit. Once it's spinning and really close to the top, you can spin it around inside to make the hole go a little bigger. Now do this slowly, keep judging the little pot, and you want the bottom of the cup to be about halfway down the pipe. I'm going to drill pilot holes first, because then that'll allow the cup to not keep grabbing the uh, pole as it goes down, mate. So I've marked out, these are four inches now, so they're going to be put, have the little cups put in. And that's the top row. Sweet. And you can do that this way. And you can lean back a little bit this way, just off center from top. And then that way, then that way. So you got all four ways just to clear it. You don't want to go too much because this one's perfect height. I don't want it to slip in and drop. I want to be able to just push it in kind of a bit of force because what we'll do, we'll go along the end. Hopefully. Um, Can't see shit, man. As you can see, the cup does not touch the bottom of the pipe, so the roots will dangle down. <laughs> All right, I do have it squished in there a little bit, but that's basically to keep the bottom of the cup at the right height, because if you open the hole too much, it's gonna slide the cup in too far. So I'm going to mark 8 inches from the centre of this hole and then I'm going to grab this thing and put it right in the centre of the mark and then we're going to do another one and then you do another 8 and do the same thing all the way that way and all the way that way. Now the cool thing is with the smaller cups I do have a smaller one of these blue things and they're going to be 4 inches apart so they're going to be smaller cups and they're going to be my herb line. So I'm going to do the herb line first, that's at the top and uh, we'll finish off the second one mate. 
some lettuce and cabbage and whatever we decide, mate. Whatever sprouts first out of the little seedling box. Sweet. Look, if you want to cheat, go to any gardening store and get a couple of little seedlings, mate. And, of course, I have a list of all the things you can grow in this and what time of year and that sort of thing, mate. Sweet. Clay pebbles cost a bit, especially if you're going to do 100 little pots like this. So you can pick up some cheap gravel from any landscaping place, mate. And look, if you're going to do it like this, it's really important to remember something I forgot, mate. <laughs> Measure one big cup worth and one small cup worth. Multiply that by how many you got, and then you can work out how much you need overall. All right, well, it's toxic Christmas here at the moment. Just make sure you don't put your drink down anywhere near where you're working, mate. Don't want to get any plastic in your beer. Now, look, I've marked them out. And what's helpful, if you don't want to be buggered doing a straight line, you could uh, sticky tape some string from there and go right through the riding to the other end of the riding. But I'm just going to wing it. The last one worked well. And they're all exactly straight up and down, mate. So if you've got that line, you only have to guess in between the riding. Da -da -da -da. So, to there. So, you know, you can kind of guess it or draw a bit of a line. Or what I actually did... I held the tape measure edge right in the middle of the riding, so the top of the tape measure edge was sitting here. Put the tape measure right through the middle of the riding, sticky tape it at one end, sticky tape it at the other end, whatever you got, mate. And then um, draw the line with pencil or pen again the whole way if you like. It doesn't have to be exact, you know. The cups could go in a little crooked and still have the roots hit the water, mate. No worries. Sweet, well, I finished my second tube and uh, I'm going to finish it off with a little hand file. But what happens, if you really get it going, the plastic bit's going to get stuck right up inside if you push it too fast. Get rid of all the rough edges, mate. And the other thing I worked out is that when you're drilling it, you've got the middle drill bit on this thing, right? So what happens is the plastic is going to get caught in the middle. So once you drill it, don't start the cup. Make sure you put this thing in and move it around a little bit to make the middle uh, pilot hole a little bigger before the cup grabs. You gotta get the pilot drill bit going first before the cup grabs and if you slow your drill to almost a stop just before you go through the little cap will pop straight out mate. I got my final row ready to go that's the herb row and that's gonna be the top row so what's happened is that my little drill bit although big enough to almost fit the cup isn't. That way you can just drop it over a box and the little cap that's inside the cup now will fall out mate Otherwise, it'll get caught on that middle bit. Happened a few times. Wasn't easy to get out. Especially when I put four on top of each other. <laughs> Sweet, mate. What are you doing? Take a photo. Uh-uh. There you go. Go see inside. Huh? I love you. <laughs> Apart from the jobs with the power tools, this is a perfect kid project and I want to see one of these in every state school in Australia, mate. Anyway, that's the grow tower and the grow beds done. And don't think I'm joking about keeping your beer away. Anyway, next stage is fish, folks. Chat soon. Sweet! Sweet!